y'all welcome back to another video it's Lydia thanks for tuning in and if you're new here be sure to subscribe I would love you if you do and hit that bell button too to be a part of the notification crew and notification squad where y'all at let me know if you're here down in the comments so I can show you some love down in the comments too um, but yeah for today's video let's just jump right in I'm going to be doing a little one product wash and go review of the main choice ancient Egyptian 24 karat glistening gold twisting gel so this product is obviously not new it's been around for a minute but it is new to me um, and I haven't tried it at all I've seen so many people rave and talk about it so many times and they've used it for a bunch of different things for like twist outs braid outs um, wash and goes all of the above and you know what I'm just really excited and I want to try it and see if it works for me the only other gold gel that I've ever like tried and kind of liked was the eco styler gold gel and I am kind of curious to see if this one is maybe even better um, and performs you know a little bit nicer especially because so many people in the world have chosen to cancel eco styler gels I mean that's just another topic for another day but let's just jump right into the details and if you're um, not wanting to like know what the details are about and you just want to see me apply it to my hair then I'll put a little timestamp and you could forward to that point so it basically says it delivers amazing definition for twist outs and braid outs. It helps mend damage and restore health. It's gentle enough for daily use. It moisturizes hair and tames frizz. Um, and it's loaded with fatty acids, omega-3, 6, and 9. And it helps to replenish hair and fight against split ends. So as of right now, I'm really looking for a product that will actually moisturize my hair. And, you know, help define my curls and hold my curls as well. Um, the last review that I did with the curls, caviar, and cashmere jelly, I don't know if you you guys have seen that video just yet um that product just did not work in my hair at all the ingredients in it I don't think it just think my hair and that just didn't work too well so I'm kind of hoping that maybe this one will work really well for me but we'll just have to keep our fingers crossed um and then in terms of the directions it just says section clean wet or damp hair apply gel sparingly to each section from roots to ends to set desired style um, it says air dry for fat or for faster drying sit under a dryer or a blow dry it says for best results use as a styling gel for twist outs and braid outs so I know you guys always ask me to do twist outs and braid outs honestly I'm not like the biggest pro when it comes to those styles um, I'm still kind of fine-tuning my skills so maybe later down the road if I notice that this gel works really well um, I'm gonna keep practicing and seeing if I can maybe do a really nice twist out with this gel right here but for today's video a lot of you guys do like my wash and goes and you guys are always looking for good product recommendations for wash and goes and you know what if it doesn't work too well um you know then I'll know that maybe if this gel just doesn't work for wash and goes but we'll just have to wait and see I've seen people who have used it for wash and goes and you know what we're just gonna have to pray and hope that it works for me but now enough of my rambling because you guys are probably like Lydia we want to see this product working in your hair stop talking um so I'm gonna take out my hair so it off and we'll jump right in so I'm just gonna wet my hair this is just water right now um, and then in terms of the packaging I should have mentioned already I love that it comes in a jar you know me I love it when my products come or at least my gels come in either a jar like this or in a pump that makes it so much easier when it comes to applying it um, and then in terms of the consistency I don't know if you guys can tell it does kind of stretch a little bit like this um, it feels really moisturizing to the touch and it has these like beautiful gold shimmers in it which is really nice but right now I'm just gonna grab maybe like a nickel to a quarter sized amount in my hands and then I'm just gonna smooth it over my hair like this okay it's smoothing through the hair really nicely and if I can say so right now I think it's clumping my curls really nicely as well um, I'm really hoping that this will actually make my curls feel super moisturized and not dry them out completely um, and that it'll give me enough definition and won't frizz up on me but as of right now this is what we are working with so this is the side with product and then right here this is my hair with no product so no product versus product um, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do this section really quickly okay so y'all know the drill let me know down below do you guys think this gel will work on my hair I'm sure a lot of you guys have already tried out this gel before some of you guys have even asked me to even try it out or what my thoughts are on it but um, yeah if you guys think my wash and goes gonna turn out good or bad let me know down below pause the video don't cheat and skip towards the end because you know I don't even know the results yet so let's be fair um, but yeah so do you think it's gonna be good or bad but for now I'm just gonna do the rest of my hair if I notice anything weird or funky going on I will be sure to check in with y'all all 
Alrighty, so I just finished up and this is what we're working with. I think it defined my curls really nicely so far. Um, there is a decent amount of shine. The biggest thing now is just waiting for my hair to dry and seeing if the definition stays, if I still have shine, if my hair gets frizzy, all that other stuff. Um, so now I'm just gonna let my hair air dry and then I will check in with y'all later. Okay, so it is day three and I didn't get to do a day two check-in for y'all just because I had a super busy Saturday yesterday. Today is Sunday um, and yeah, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys what my day three results are looking like and to be honest, I think my day three results are looking pretty great and I'm pretty sure I can get another like two to three days out of this wash and go um, moving forward. Um, now, in terms of the claims, I would say that it definitely helped control frizz, um, not as much as some of my holy grails do. Like I can tell in the back it's maybe starting to feel a little dry and a little frizzy and a little bit here on the front, but that's mostly also because um, this gel is a little bit higher in the protein count than maybe some other gels. Um, but I would say that this gel is definitely a lot more moisturizing, even though it has protein in it. For me, usually whenever I go in with gels that do have protein in it, it completely dries out my hair. Like for instance, the curls um, cashmere and caviar. If you guys have seen my recent video trying that out, my curls were just dry, dull, they looked tired, um, and I definitely definitely don't think my curls feel like that now. I would say maybe a little bit in the front. Um, I may need to reinforce it with some like refresher sprays or moisturizing sprays or something up here. Um, but all in all, I think my results are pretty good given all of that. And I think it lived up to its claims for the most part. Um, like I said, I was just wishing that maybe my hair had a little bit more shine to it, but I don't think it looks that bad. But let me know down below if you guys like this gel. Have you tried it out? Um, what do you think of it? Is it a keeper? Is it not. Um, I think even though it says it's recommended for twist outs and braid outs, I still think it worked pretty well for a wash and go. So if you've been scared to try out this gel um, and you like to do wash and goes, I definitely would recommend maybe picking it up and trying it out. Um, will it replace my holy grails or will it be added to my holy grail, um, you know, collection of hair gels and stuff like that? I don't think I don't think so, but I definitely think it's a good gel if that makes sense. And that's just me being as transparent as and as honest as I can be. Um, it smells great. This gel smells great. It works pretty well. It's just not up there with my holy grails. I definitely like the main choice braid out glaze, the blue one, um, a lot more than I like this gel for sure. But all in all, those are my thoughts. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below if you plan on trying out this gel or if you've tried it out. Let me know what your thoughts are. Sound off down below. And if you made it all the way to the end of this video you're a real one but be sure to comment the word gold down below just because this is a gold twisting gel so yeah comment the word gold down below and be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and i post multiple videos a week every week so be sure to subscribe i would love you if you do i won't i won't hate you if you don't but i would love you if you do and be sure to share this with a friend as well but thanks again y'all and i'll see you in the next one peace